The Vishva Hindu Parishad IAST, Visva Hindu Parishada, pronunciation, Vivi, HN, U Prode, translation, World Hindu Council, abbreviated VHP, is an Indian right-wing Hindu nationalist organization based on the ideology of Hindutva. The VHP was founded in 1964 by M. S. Golwakar and S. S. A. P. T. E. in collaboration with Swami Chinmayananda. Its stated objective is to organize, consolidate the Hindu society and to serve, protect the Hindu dharma." The VHP is a member of the Sangh Parivar Group, an umbrella of Hindu nationalist organizations led by the Rashtriya Swayamsevak Sangh It has been involved in construction and renovation of Hindu temples, issues of cow slaughter, religious conversion, the Ayodhya dispute and its role in the Babri Masjid demolition. History The VHP was founded in 1964 by RSS leaders M. S. Golwakar and S. S. A. P. T. E. in collaboration with the Hindu spiritual leader Chinmayananda. The delegation of the founders included Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan founder K. M. Munshi, Gujarati scholar Kashavram Kashiram Shastri, Sikh leader Master Tara Singh, Namdari Sikh leader Satguru Jagjit Singh and eminent politicians such as C. P. Ramaswamy Iyer. Chinmayananda was nominated as its founding president, while A. P. T. E. was nominated as its founding general secretary. It was decided at the meeting that the name of the proposed organization would be Vishva Hindu Parishad and that a World Convention of Hindus was to be held at Prayag Allahabad during Kumbha Mela of 1966 for its launch. It was further decided that it would be a non-political organization and that no office-bearer of any political party shall be simultaneously an office-bearer in the Parishad. In mid-1990s, VHP had 1.6 million members worldwide. According to a 2008 estimate, VHP claimed 6.8 million members. Ideology The VHP, which considers Buddhists, Jains and Sikhs as well as native tribal religions as part of the Greater Hindu Fraternity, officially mentions that it was founded by the Saint Shakti of Bharat. The VHP was first mooted at a conference in Pawai, Sandipani Sadanalaya, Bombay on 29 August 1964. The conference was hosted by RSS Chief M. S. Golwakar. The date was chosen to coincide with the festival of Janmashtami. Several representatives from the Hindu, Sikh, Buddhist and Jain faiths were present in the meeting, as well as the Dalai Lama. Golwakar explained that, "...all faiths of Indian origins need to unite," saying that the word, "...Hindu," people of, "...Hindustan," applied to adherents of all the above religions. APTE declared, The world has been divided to Christian, Islam and Communist. All of them view Hindu society as very fine rich food on which to feast and fatten themselves. It is necessary in this age of conflict to think of and organize the Hindu world to save it from the evils of all the three. Its main objective is, "...to organize, consolidate the Hindu society and to serve, protect the Hindu dharma." It has been involved in social service projects and in encouraging the construction and renovation of Hindu temples. It is against the caste system, opposes cow slaughter and conversions to other religions. Defending Hindus around the world and Hindu rights has been one of its stated objectives. The other main objective which it has been involved with is the Ayodhya dispute. On 4 June 2018, CIA classified VHP and Bairung Dal as religious militant organizations under the category of political pressure groups. The organization acts under the guidance from Dharma Sansad, a religious parliament of gurus. The VHP is associated with the Sangh Parivar, an umbrella of Hindu nationalist organizations. Its slogan is Dharmo Raksati Raksita, which means, Dharma protects its protector, and its symbol is the banyan tree. The current international president of VHP is Vishnu Sadashiv Kokya, while its international working president is Alec Kumar Advocate. <laughs> Social services Vishva Hindu Parishad is active in social welfare work. Medical – people are trained in villages to provide primary health care and referral services. The organization also conducts medical checkup camps. 
Vocational training – Organization is running self-employment training camps in Bihar, Punjab, Rajasthan, Maha Kaushal, Assam, Bridge Pradesh, Odisha and Maharashtra. The training areas involve farming techniques, beekeeping, agriculture, horticultural techniques, animal husbandry and sewing. There are 959 training centers currently operating. Education – It tried to provide educational facilities in remote area. It supports 3,266 educational facilities. Social welfare – Organization runs 45 orphanages, marriage bureau, help centers, rescue centers, temples, hostels and working women hostels. VHP is also active in environmental causes such as tree plantations. Social services are provided in religious pilgrimages, emergency help during natural calamities and rural development. Relief Services – Vishwa Hindu Parishad has provided emergency relief services. In 2014 Jammu and Kashmir floods, Vishwa Hindu Parishad organized medical and relief camps. These services provided relief via medical camps to 1400 patients. <laughs> Youth organizations The Bairung Dal founded in 1984, is organized in many states in major training camps called shakas, where thousands of youths simultaneously train in various activities, receive sports, education in Hindutva and cultural indoctrination. The Durga Vahini, founded in 1991 under the tutelage of Sadvi Rithambara as its founding chairperson and the support of the VHP, is described as the female arm of the Dal. Members of the Vahini contend that the portrayal of their group as a branch of the Bairung Dal is an oversimplification, and that their goals are to "...dedicate ourselves to spiritual, physical, mental and knowledge development." The VHP also have divisions made up of women. VHP Secretary Jiri Raj Kishore charted out highly visible roles for women in the group. He charted out two "...satyagrahas." For women during their demonstrations, the VHP has been a prime backer of the World Hindu Conference in which issues such as casteism, sectarianism, and the future of Hindus were discussed. Prior conferences have included Hindu groups such as Parisada Hindu Dharma. <laughs> <laughs> International presence Vishwa Hindu Parishad is active in many countries outside of India. Known as VHPA, the VHP and the United States Advocates for Human Rights for Hindus around the world. They also offer Hindu pandits to serve the Hindu community, and usually hold rituals around the nation where members are invited. The VHPA has also organized many charitable causes, such as raising money for the victims of Typhoon Haiyan in 2013, and the Fiji flood victims of 2012. The VHP UK is the British branch of the Vishwa Hindu Parishad, which has held demonstrations in London for the rights of Hindus in Bangladesh and Pakistan. It offers many Hindu services, such as priests and matrimonial services. VHP UK has been vocal advocates of the pro life movement, and stands against abortion. Vishwa Hindu Parishad has a temple in Frankfurt, offers Bhagavad Gita classes, and recites the Ramayana. The VHP is active in Vancouver, Toronto, Edmonton, Winnipeg, Ottawa, and other major Canadian cities. The Vishwa Hindu Parishad is gaining popularity in these countries. The Australia wing of Vishva Hindu Parishad conducts activities such conducting weekend schools, language classes, cultural workshops, festivals. The festivals are also organized for open to all communities promoting unity and diversity. The press release from City Council of Holroyd state that Vishva Hindu Parishad is active in supporting multiculturalism in the same region. In March 2014, the VHP had its first National Hindu Council in Fiji and New Zealand. The VHP has established a Vedic school in Sydney, has temples and organised three national Hindu conferences in 2014. Other activities VHP organizes programs to reconvert Hindus who had previously converted to Christianity or Islam through their trained missionaries called Dharma Prasar Vibhag Dharma Propagation Unit. Some of them were sent to remote villages and tribal areas which have substantial Christians and Muslims population. 
From 1982 to 1985, over 66,000 people were reconverted to Hinduism following the efforts of VHP. The VHP had been aggressively involved in the Ayodhya dispute over the Ram Janmabhoomi, or Babri Mosque, before its demolition. Since March 1984, after getting encouraged by the strong response it had got from Ekatmata Yatra program, it organized in 1983, which was aimed at Hindu unity and self protection against Islam and Christianity. This activity in the Ayodhya issue involved demonstrations, petitions and litigation, along with militant processions, forceful conversion ceremonies and incidents of violence and vandalism, particularly targeting Muslims. The VHP is also said to have sought the destruction of the Babri Mosque. According to the VHP and its affiliated organizations, the Babri Mosque was built by demolishing the temple at the birthplace of Rama Ram Janmabhumi by the Mughal Emperor Babur in the 16th century. It further stated in Allahabad court documentation that the building was in a dilapidated condition. It was in ruins and could not be used for worship or any activities. In Punjab, the VHP has played an active role to prevent conversions of Sikhs. Majority of them are low caste Sikhs converting to Christianity. This may be a result of oppression by high caste Sikhs, but there are considerable free will conversions among the higher class Sikhs too. However, the VHP have forcibly stopped Christian missionaries from converting Sikhs. According to the Human Rights Watch, VHP and Bayrung Dal had been involved in 2002 Gujarat riots. Though VHP has denied these claims, VHP spokesman Kashikbahi Mehta said, we in the VHP had nothing to do with the violence except to take care of widows and victims of the Ghadra mayhem. VHP engaged in reconversion program in the state of Orissa. In June 2002, VHP converted 143 tribal Christians into Hinduism in Tainzer village of Sundargarh district. In 2005, VHP in Bargar carried out reconversion ceremony for 567 Christians. The new converts had signed affidavits, confirming their intention to change their religion. Another 600 Dalit tribal Christians were converted to Hinduism in Bijapur, Orissa. On April 2005, in West Bengal members of 45 tribal families converted to Hinduism from Christianity in a ceremony organized by Ukhil Bhartiya Sanatan Santhal, allied to VHP. VHP claimed to have converted 5,000 people to Hinduism in 2002. In 2004, VHP claimed to have converted 12,857 people to Hinduism, 3,727 of these were Muslims and 9,130 were Christians. In 2005, after the protests organized by VHP, the Jharkhand Assembly passed a Cow Protection Commission bill that made the killing of, cruelty to, and illegal trading of cows a crime. In 2007, VHP had launched nationwide protest against demolition of the Rama Setu. On 12 September 2007, the VHP, with the aid of BJP and the Ramaswaram Sriramsetu Surakshaya Manch, had blocked road and rail traffic in Orissa. Thousands of activists participated in these protests in Bhubaneswar, Jatani, Rorkela, and Sambalpur. In 2015, VHP defended the demolition of a church in Haryana, although it has denied involvement in the incident. VHP Joint General Secretary Surendra Jain alleged that the church was built for the purpose of aggressive conversion," and likened its destruction to the violence of the 1857 war which he claimed was fought for the cause of religion. <laughs> 